How to calculate growth rate or percent change. Subtract, divide, and multiply your way to successfully determining how much that increase or decrease really amounts to. You will need the current amount, the past amount, and a calculator. Optional, the future predicted amount. Step one, subtract the past number from the current number. For example, if the price of gas this year was $3.25 a gallon and last year it was $2.75 a gallon, calculate $3.25 minus $2.75 to equal 50 cents. To calculate the predicted percent increase or decrease, subtract the current amount from the future predicted amount. Step two, divide the past number from the subtracted amount. From the earlier example, divide 50 cents by $2.75 to equal 0.1818. Use a calculator if your division skills need sharpening. Step three, multiply the final number by 100. In the example, the end result equals 18.18. .18. Step four, add a percent sign to the end to finish your calculated percent growth. Our example ends in 18.18%. .18%. If the final number is negative, the result would be a decline, not a growth. Step 5. Round up if the number is 5 or over, and round down if the number is under 5. Rounding to the first decimal would equal 18.2%, or to the nearest whole number, 18%. Did you know? French mathematician Blaise Pascal invented the first adding machine in 1642. It could only perform the mathematical equations of addition and subtraction.